Uh, hi, my name's Seth. I go to Devonport High School. I'm in year 10. And today we're here at Fairbrothers to talk to David Parker. So let's go have a chat. So David, can you tell us a bit about Fairbrothers? Yeah, Fairbrothers is a major building company in Tasmania, probably one of the biggest. Yep. And that uh, mainly doing construction type work on large constructions all over the state. So what's your role here at Fairbrothers? Uh, on this particular job, I'm site foreman, which I coordinate all our blokes and all, yep. also the subcontractors, and that to work and yeah, get this job through to the end. So, what's a typical day look like here? Oh, usually first half of the morning, we have a little bit of a talk and work out which way we're heading, yeah, who's working where. Uh, obviously, if there's any safety concerns, we talk about that, and then we just work our way into the job. Uh, so, what's your favourite part about being a site foreman? Uh, probably the vary, variation on all the stuff we do. Like every job's different and uh, you get to deal with a lot of people, a lot of subcontractors. Uh, what are some of the opportunities in the industry that people might not realise? Uh, with Fairbrothers, our company, like a lot of the young fellas do their apprenticeship and then they work their way up into lead and hand roles and foreman roles. And we've got quite a few that have ended up in the office running jobs from there as a project manager and uh, even up into a general manager. So. So what experience in education do you have? Um, I think you only need to have level two passes in, in your three or four main subjects, but obviously you're a little bit higher than that, it's probably a bit easier, but grade 10 sort of thing. So what sort of people are best suited to this? Probably people that like to, they don't mind getting their hands dirty, they like doing physical type work rather than sitting behind an office desk. Someone looking to get into the construction industry, what pathways should they be looking at? Uh, there's a few different ways, like obviously doing work experience work uh, through your school, and that's definitely a good way. Uh, there is pre-voc type courses you can do, and that as well. And that and probably just put your name down at local building firms and any other industries related. Uh, I was just wondering if you could tell, possibly tell me a bit, a, bit, a bit more about what's happening around the site here. Uh, this is a, a demolition site that we took over some time ago, and it's going to be turned into a a gourmet type supermarket and uh, that uh, so basically we've been redesigning the building getting it up to a standard to suit uh, supermarkets so thanks david today has been great to get inside in the construction industry so hopefully this gives students a better idea what to expect and give a bit better insight about pathways in the construction industry <laughs>